Country houses it is then. Let us get some country houses built uh, down here. Look at this. We're going to get them built like sort of uh, down here. Uh, I want to zoom in, uh, but it actually, the button I'm used to zooming actually rotates it refined. We're going to knock down this shack and we're going to build what? Like, there we go. God, they cost a lot, actually, these houses. Three houses. Okay, three houses next to... The so at least some people will be able to move in. How many people are actually living in these houses right now? Who's in here? Holy shit, there's like four fucking families living in this country house. Okay, well, we'll be able to pack in a whole bunch of people into these country houses, so that'll be nice. Uh, and we've got... Oh, look at that. The Great four news. people that left have While come back. While searching through the crates of colony supplies, we found a sickle. Oh, fantastic. Now oh, look we have at something Penultimo. that goes perfectly with our hammers. This will boost production sky high. I can almost see the glorious future. Wow. Okay, plantation upgrades have been unlocked, which means that with our two research points, apparently we can... Um, can we farm upgrades? We've done it. Have we done it? We're currently not researching anything. Uh, can we scroll over? It's all this crow. My fucking god. Look at all this shit. Look at that. Swiss future. The internet. Look at that. E-government. Free Wi-Fi and IT education. My god. Oh, that's going to be fantastic. Okay. Uh, we've done this one. Farm upgrades. Uh, do we want to... Um, we've unlocked plantation upgrades. Should we go check out what those look like? We can now upgrade our plantations. Uh, where's that? Upgrades. Increases the effectiveness of all other nearby plantations and hydroponic farms by 10. Based on effectiveness. Max 30. Okay, so there's nothing to add. Oh, oh yeah, no, that's four thousand bucks. Which, ah, I see, fiber fertilization. <laughs> do we want to do this for four thousand bucks? I don't know. I mean, we only have four thousand two hundred thirty-six. Uh, but we've just exported two thousand seven hundred thirty-seven worth of sugar. Oh, look at that. We've almost reached that goal. Holy shit! It's only going to get better too, because look, we've got this other plantation here now too. All right, let's let these houses go up first. See if we can just like extort people for rents, get a bit more over 4,000, uh, and then we will upgrade that plantation because it looks kind of cool actually. Are, are people moving into here? Has anyone moved in? They have. Look at that. There's like four fucking families living in this little tiny country house. You gotta love the graphics. Look at this. It's so nice. Holy shit. Look at all these people just like strolling around, having a nice time. Look, they're, they've got a cooking fire. I say, being a crown colony Oaksworth, is a you kind of the competition one you are losing, old chap. Oh, really? The colonies of Puerto Coco and Isla Rojo are beating you badly. Well, Oaksworth, that won't do. I'm just trying to find my feet here. I'm just trying to live my life. And actually, you coming in here and um, shitting all over my good time is not the best. Uh, in fact, islands of Puerto Coco and Isla Rojo are doing so well that the crown has come to expect much more from you also. That is a, a goddamn shit. His Majesty has decided since the region is doing quite well, all colonies should pay higher tax this year. Oh shit. Pay double tax. That'll give me a 12 month mandate extension and don't pay the tax. Uh, and His Majesty will um, try to destroy me. Okay, uh, we'll pay the extra tax. And that's going to set us back 5,000 bucks and actually put us in massive amounts of debt. Damn it. Oh no. It's all, it's all going so bad. What's, what's this? The burden of ruling twists our perception. Was that just uh, done on purpose? To us, oh. People are just a resource that has to be managed properly. Oh, Billy Connolly is so fucking angry in this game, it's unbelievable. Okay, speaking of managing people, you can attract additional managers to you, and you can then assign them to your most important buildings to improve their performance. All you need is to build some new housing for the managers. Okay, so managers will live in country houses, uh, and then five managers will immigrate to the island. Okay, cool. New country. I just built fucking three! Oh, see, that's why you should never build stuff outside of the grid. Damn it. Look at that. I was getting so ahead of myself that I wasted... Ah, uh, damn it. And there's still people living in shacks. That is terrible. What about this? The revolution is a struggle oh, for hey. freedom. See you again. And there are few as free as the pirates. Oh, yeah. We should befriend and learn from them. Uh, I 
Do I want to befriend and learn from pirates? Build a new tavern uh, and we'll get revolutionary support. Um, you might have heard the pirates like to get drunk and have fun. Um, I like to get drunk and have fun. Um, all right, Evita. Let's fucking do it. We're going to build a tavern as soon as we get some more money um, from exporting fucking sugar. Good grief. I mean, these guys are just, like, traveling around with these little cars. <laughs> fucking... We need some cars. We need some vans to come and pick up this... Whoa, shit. How much stuff is he carrying right now? Oh, look. It's Gemma Colon. Gemma Colon. <laughs> it's my distant relative who is... Um, oh, shit. Is there, like, a... Did she just stop because this guy was going by? Is there, like, a, like a hidden traffic signal system <laughs> on these dirt roads? It's possible. Shit, I hope we make a ton of money from these deliveries. Because we need it. Where's this boat? That's nowhere to be seen. <laughs> we can't do shit. We've got minus 2,269 bucks. I'm already failing miserably at this game. Oh, look. They fucking dropped it all off, though. How much shit is here? You can actually see. Expected revenue is 2,972 bucks. We might go back up into the green. Uh, our corn uh, is at 1,631. And our sugar is at 2,901. And there's the boat. Great. Just in fucking time. And we need this money. And actually, the longer it goes on, the less we're making. Jesus. Uh, we're probably going to need to wait for another delivery as well before we can actually get enough money to build a country house. How much does it cost to build a tavern? His Royal Majesty has instructed me to present you with this oh. letter of commendation Great. for your achievements in the name of the Empire. Oh, fantastic, Oaksworth. I was going to get mad at you for interrupting me, but actually this treasury subsidy of 5,000 bucks is much needed at the moment. I can build some country houses and get managers in. And then upgrade my plantations. Woo! <laughs> 5,731 bucks. Great. Okay. Country houses cost 1,500. I can't believe it. But it provides housing for four families. And it provides food for the residents as well. Fine. We will build two of these for now. Along here. And we'll save the rest of our money just in case. Cool. And uh, we should actually... Uh, oh, no. Oh, maybe just in time. Look. Some more boxes. Stick around, boat. You know you want to stick around for more boxes. Come on, show me the money. Show me the money. Is it going to work? Uh, look at that. It's worked. We got some more money. Great. Oh, look at how much we exported. 4,372 bucks worth. That's great. Okay. And uh, we passed that export the sugar thing for the underwater palace, and that's why we got 5,000 bucks. Great. Your family's rather rollicking love life has led to an unexpected pregnancy. You fucking what, Penultimo? What the hell? Uh, as any other important birth, the event will grab the attention of people far and wide. It may even cause some controversy. How should we handle this, Presidente? Organize a quick wedding. Build a new Catholic mission in nine months. Uh, pay to keep things quiet. That's going to cost me 5,000 bucks. Uh, I like a good scandal. Uh, okay, we're going to have to do this. We're going to have to organize a quick... <laughs> or we can simply not acknowledge the child. Will this have long-term impact on us? I'm certain it will. But then again, maybe organizing a quick wedding will too. All right, fuck it. We're not acknowledging the child. <laughs> oh, shit. I have no idea what's going to happen. Uh, research, I guess we just want to, like, uh, upgrade... Do we want to upgrade the shovel? We can do it. No? The shovel. Fine. Let's do it. We're upgrading the shovel for some unknown reason. I mean, maybe we can make some more money uh, that way. But actually, the sugar plantations are doing quite well. I think, in fact, look at that. Lifetime profit, 4,692. And this one's only made 2,077. Many people are ready to give their life for their ideals. Damn it, silly. You must be ready to take lives for yours. I, I, I'm not ready. You don't agree with me? I'll have to take matters into my own hands and show you. Okay, the royalists on your island do not support independence and lower your approval. I have arranged for the deaths of several of them. Wow, Billy Connolly, holy shit. This is an important lesson. Sometimes you have to make sacrifices to achieve your goals. Uh, the effect is several royalists have been killed. Okay. Bang, 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 bang. No? No. Okay. We've got enough money to build one more country house, which we should probably build here. We've done it. 
And the crown has just sent me 6,500 bucks. So actually, we can build the other two country houses. Holy shit, talk about good timing. Uh, where do we want these? We're gonna build one here on this intersection and knock down this crappy shack. And uh, there should be room for one more here, too. Wow, okay. But our little island's really coming together now. Okay, perfect. Three more country houses, uh, and we should be able to attract some managers. And we will be able to appoint some managers. Look at all these people who live right down the road from a corn farm. Not many people in this life can say that, that they live so close to a corn farm. These people can, and I think that that's a big plus in their lives. Maybe not such a minus. I mean, if we build some houses over here, then all these people will be able to brag about how close they live to sugar plantations. Uh, and then we can have some sort of civil war between corn lovers and sugar lovers uh, for the ultimate battle of supremacy. Can you imagine? That would be one to watch. And in fact, if it was on pay-per-view, I, I would totally pay. I see the ready. Unfortunately, uh -oh. the islands of Puerto Coco and Isla Rojo have kidnapped the managers intended for you. What the hell? Why? I built those houses. I need those managers. Uh, as I understand it, they offered large mansions to get the managers from under your nose. Oh, I see. Don't worry much about it. You'll be able to get them back at some point. In the meantime, I use the order's connections to get an extension to your mandate. Okay, well, that's nice. Thank you, Leon Kane, uh, a.k.a. Billy Connolly, for extending my mandate by 12 months. That's great. We have we have some breathing room now. Phew. Okay, uh, do we want to build a tavern? Uh, will a tavern make us some money? That might be nice. I'm guessing it's going to be in here. There it is. Oh, look at this. Oh, shit. Look at that. That's fantastic. Provides entertainment for citizens living in the vicinity. Okay, we're going to build it here for all the corn lovers. Uh, what is that? Why is it gone like all green around here? Do we want it to be like down here somewhere? Or do we want it to be right behind the library? Uh, that's a fantastic spot for it, actually. We're going to have it right behind the library uh, so that when things get really rowdy and every everybody's in the library trying to read their books and stuff, they'll like just sort of launch themselves at the windows and uh, pick fights with all the people at the tavern who are being all rowdy. And it'll be like another mini civil war between uh, bookworms and tavern goers. All right, tavern, show us what you got. I hope that people can actually access the... our research. Oh shit! That is to that me. Discovered the shovel. Oh, forty times. Whoa! If I find out who put it there, I will kill him. No. Anyway, I gave it to the miners so they can put it somewhere safe, like underground. Hey, we got mines. Okay, it's time to make more money. Let us also re. Whoa! Hey, look at this! Hey, look at all this shit! Oh wow! Look, we can make planks and foremen. Manager skills for production buildings. Wow, okay. Do we want to research any of this cool stuff? What is, what's this? We don't have any ranches. I don't think we need a military fort, but potentially maybe we can have a lumber mill? I mean, I'm up for cutting down trees. Let's do it. Lumber mill. Planks. All right, penultimo. Fucking do your worst. That's going to be great. All right. Um, do we need... Uh, do we have... No, we don't have money to upgrade uh, our sugar plantations unfortunately so we're gonna have to wait uh this tavern is gonna be built fairly soon uh which should hopefully oh shit here we go uh this is gonna be the big one these two things are working like full tilt now we're gonna make so much money from this it's gonna be crazy and eight new people have arrived in tropical eight new people what's happening to our population look we had 71 and now it's only 70 so people are like leaving are people smuggling themselves into these crates and, and leaving Thanks the island that way the revolutionary movement is growing stronger. Yeah, because of a tavern. As a sign of gratitude for your support of the movement, the revolutionaries have offered their help. Remember, you need to increase the approval rating above 50% to declare independence. Increasing the number of revolutionaries on the island will greatly help you with that task. Okay, cool. Uh, do we want to have new trade routes with smugglers? Or do we want to have uh, 2000 bucks in our Swiss bank account? 